you're seeing a congregation of basically all of the local Midwest Purple Martins. There are n numerous roosts around this region. One's in Carthage, Missouri, there's one in Tulsa, there's one in Oklahoma, and they're all basically um, occurring at the same time. Right now, we'll probably have about 10, 15, maybe 20,000 birds tonight. That population will probably double in the next week because all the Nebraska, Dakota, Canadian birds, which fly through this flyway, will come here and stop. And they're just gonna stop and feed because of there's so many dragonflies that are being produced right now. They will congregate in a place like this because the lights of this parking lot keep the predators away, keep the owls and the hawks away. So they will congregate together for self-protection because the houses that they've grown in, the trees where they live in a hollow concavity, they've outgrown it with all their young. So they're very susceptible to an owl reaching in and grabbing them and, and eating them. So they, for self-protection, they accumulate a large, they call it a roost. So you're probably wondering, how do we find a roost? Well, several of us go around yearly and try to find where it's at. It's moved on occasion. Like, this is the first time I've known it to be out east. Typically, it's St. Francis Hospital. For several years, it was down at uh, Old Town. For a number of years, um, the guys that I've talked to who have been doing this longer than I have said it was down on the river. And there were some trees down there that they really congregated and said he cut the trees down. But in the morning, when they wake up and go, it's just before sunrise. They'll all bloom out like a big donut on Doppler radar. That's where they find them on the Weather Service Doppler radar.